First down, Breeze. They'll set up the screen now to Camara. And some space here. And he's brought down after a very nice game. Camara, that's good for a save. And I think that's a pretty good illustration of why they try to get the football into his hands out of the backfield. That was something else. And we talk so much from a defensive perspective about scheming and finding ways to take away the run. That means the offense has to devise different ways to get the ball in the hands of their guy out of the backfield. Find open space, let him run, and big things can happen, and they did right there. And according to Next Gen Stats, his top speed on that one, better than 20 miles an hour. The first carry now, this is Alvin Kamara, and they'll get him down as he's inside the 40. 12 yards there, good for a Saints first down. Breeze to throw on third and one. Out of the backfield, that's complete to Kamara. And this is going to turn into another first down as the tackle is made at the Vikings' 12-yard line. It's a gain of five. Brings up second. On second down, Kamara. And he'll take it into the end zone for the Saints' touchdown. Taking it in from seven yards away. And the Saints have taken the early lead. A strong, determined run there, Charles, to get in for six points. This is why it's such a team game, isn't it? And I know that sounds really generic, and it sounds almost trite, but the blocks were made up front. Off. On first and ten, here's Breeze. They'll tussle for it, and this is going to be caught. And yeah, they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. That's a good way to start the drive. 17 yards and a first. I just need something right here. And the end result there, nice first down. Drive keeps moving. Yeah, he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. That's good. And that one heck of a run right there. Once he got loose, you can tell that he was going to run a long way. That was pretty impressive. And first and foremost, this is all about vision. He can see the play developing right in front of him. And once he's past the line of scrimmage and got a full head of steam behind him, he's just going to keep right on up. On the ground, this is Kamara. Oh, and now he bowls him over. And he takes this just a few yards shy of the red zone before going out. Another good gain. That's now 35 yard yard line. A two-yard pickup brings up third. They stay on the ground. This time it's Kamara. And stopped a few yards shy of the goal line at the three. That's good for a Saints. We use the word relentless a lot with guys who are aggressive on the field. Try to pound it in, Kamara. We live for this. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, New Orleans. Alvin Kamara with his second touchdown here in this first half. Saints add on to their lead. And always a good first half when you can hit pay dirt twice. And it never hurts to have that good feeling as the game moves on. Just think about halftime. If, it, if that's his only position, thanks to the interception. A tenth carry for Camara. And they've got it inside the 10 at the 8. Give him 10 yards there and about by the Nishman. He's in Orlando and he'll have our EA Sports halftime report. And he takes it across and into the end zone. Touchdown, Saints. Alvin Kamara on his way to a monster game. Three first half touchdowns. And the Saints now add six to their lead. So simple math here in the first half. They've had three drives offensively and they had scored every time and they've got the lead. Well, whenever we talk about adjustments, we usually talk about an offense making adjustments, right? This is all about the... From the gun, it's Breeze. That's complete to his running back, Kamara. And past the 40. Before your eyes move and scan the field. And here he finds the open guy for a nice pickup. That's to his running back. It's Alvin Kamara. And he'll take this to the second and 10. To throw on second and 10. Breeze. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And he'll be out just a yard or two shy of the 30. That'll be a gain of 15 yards. Play should get some six. To throw is Breeze. Now they go screen. It's complete. And brought down, but not before reach 
approaching the 45-yard line. 14 yards is the pickup. First down, New Orleans. Let's give a little credit there. The offensive play caller since that the screen pass was available. Whenever you're getting a lot of heavy pressure towards your quarterback, that's when you're thinking about running the screen and using that pressure against the defense. And it works. They'll get only a yard out of that, and it'll bring up fourth down. Well, offensively, that's the mismatch that you want. You want to force a linebacker to try and cover your back out of the backfield, out in some open space. On the ground, Kamara. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. Another nice approach. When you're going to get him, sometimes you panic as well and think, I've got to be there right now. Instead, in this case, timed it perfectly and knocked it free. That burst good for 20 and a first down. Well, I tell you what, when you get a running back who can move like that in the open field, that's something to take advantage of, and they certainly did there. And there's an old chestnut of an expression called getting on your horse. And I hate to use it, but I'm going to right here because it absolutely applies. He was pushing 20 miles an hour. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he'll take it into the end zone for the Saints touchdown. Taking it in from four yards out. And the Saints able to stretch that lead out further. Circle that drive because that might be one to remember. Well executed to give him a little cushion. Well, let's take it into the boxing ring. You talk about them commanding it, keeping the fight where they wanted to, whether it was in the center of the ring or putting them on the ropes because it was jammed. They get set for the next drive. Off the play fake to Kamara. It's Breeze. Oh, there's that man again. It's complete. And they're able to get this one across the 35. Of New Orleans rolling along here in the third quarter. Second and 10. They find some open field here. And they've got it well across midfield down to the 40 before it's all said and done. That one covers 24 yards. Clock, see if you can continue to tick it down. Definitely, you want to bleed things out at this point, right? Continue to possess the football, gain some yardage, put the onus on the defense. Do they have to use time? Get them to fourth down. No, fourth down. Here we go with Kamara. And he is out of bounds, getting it down to the 10. Give him credit. They knew what they... Here's Kamara trying to run for it. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, New Orleans. A three-yard touchdown run. And the Saints add on to their lead. And that rushing touchdown is fourth. Puts him just one shy of the NFL record in a single game. And we all know he would love to get coming out hot. They expected it and got there and popped it free. On third down, here's Kamara. And he gets it inside the 10 to the 9. Third and medium, they opt to your quarterback. Hey, no time to be a hero. We're not going to throw it here. Just eat up that clock. And, if and he'll barrel his way into the end zone for a safe touchdown. A five-yard touchdown run. And the Saints now at six to their lead. We got a little bit of everything on that run. Offensive line creating some space. But how about the guy running behind his pads into the end zone? says running behind his pad. Means that he's going to be a physical runner. That way he's able to use his shoulder pads, his forearm. So after the run for no gain, here's second and ten. Oh, it's a screen pass. That's complete. And he takes us beyond the 35 before going out of bounds. Good for a save. They'll run out of the gun with Kamara. He'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. Another nice gain, 16 yards there, and a first down again. Well, that's a carry they have to be satisfied with, and throughout this game, they've been satisfied with what he's given them. Whenever they've needed a big run, a first down, he's the guy they've turned to, and it doesn't matter what the defense thinks. They feel like they've got the confidence to keep handing it to him and keep picking up good yards. First and 10. Breeze is looking to throw. They'll try and set up the screen. It's complete. And he is out of bounds inside the 35. Another nice gain. That's now 30. Back to the ground. It's Kamara. And they'll bring him down at the 18-yard line. That carry. Here's second and seven. Now they set up the screen. That's complete. And able to get him down, but he did. 
Here's Breeze to throw. Flushed out right. And this will be caught. We'll forget taking the knee. Some late games. Here's a throw for a late touchdown. Is it okay if I break one of our rules, partner, which is to never call a game over until it's over because this certainly feels like it's over after that drive yeah that was spirit crushing wasn't it and now you can you just kind of felt the air go out of the balloon yeah they were fighting so hard to stay in there and they knew they had to stop them on that drive but when they were unable to i, I think you're exactly right you could see them sag on their sideline and i think this one might just be over So that'll do it for my partner, Charles Davis, and the best darn crew in the industry. I'm Brandon Gaunt. This has been a presentation of the NFL on EA Sports. The Saints are winners here as we say so long from New Orleans.